हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन योर पी एजुकेशन सो फ्रेंड्स एक वैकेंसी आई थी इंदिरा गांधी सेंटर ऑफ अटोमिक रिसर्च के अंदर जो कि डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ अटोमिक एनर्जी के अंदर है उसका जो लास्ट डेट है वो एक्सटेंड हुआ है ओके okay, तो अगर आपने अभी तक वैकेंसी के बारे में अपडेट नहीं लिया है तो वो भी देख लो एंड प्लीज सी द लास्ट डेट ऑल्सो सो जस्ट गो टू द रिक्रूटमेंट सेक्शन ऑफ दिस एंड देन यू कैन सी हेयर एडवर्टाइजमेंट नंबर जीरो टू स्लैश सो यू कैन अप्लाई क्लिक हेयर टू अप्लाई एंड यू कैन सी द PDF, okay. You can see the PDF. So closing date is initially is fourteen five, okay. Or we can say closing date is fourteen five. Now basically here you can see, okay. So let me tell you again. Here you can see. Click here for the details. So here you can see. So. The last date for receipt of receipt of online application is extended up to three six twenty twenty one, and hard copy of application for the post code this this and this should reach to the recruitment section on before ten six twenty twenty one. Okay, all other uh, terms condition remain unchanged. Now, what are those terms and conditions? Let me uh, give you that also. So here you can see the advertisement. So for B Tech students. so for btech students these categories uh, these vacancies are for phd students only for btech students these are the basically we can say uh, useful information for chemical engineering students three vacancies are there for civil two vacancy computer science one electrical three electronics six instrumentation two mechanical seven vacancy 17 vacancies are there mechatronics one metallurgy three chemistry one vacancy and physics one vacancies there okay total 41 vacancies are there and you need to have bachelor degree in any of this branch okay to apply with minimum 60% marks now here you can see no experience is required and uh, pay is 56100 uh, in level of 10 of pay matrix plus da plus allowance of uh, to the central government servants okay and minimum age is 18 and maximum is 35 years on the date of receipt of online application and the job is permanent now let's discuss about the scheme of examination and methods of selection so the post of uh, the process of selection involved two stages written test and uh, personal interview written test containing uh, basically of 2 hours compromising 75 questions and each question carry 3 marks and one negative marks for each incorrect answer now the whatever the marks obtained in written test are just for shortlisting the candidate for personal interview there is no uh, basically addition of marks of written test in final we can say selection process final selection is based on just personal interview so you can just follow your pedia uh, interview series and mock series for just cracking this interview but first of all you need to crack this written test okay and uh, this is all about this uh, notification for btech students okay so here you can see the details so there are many post based on the other qualifications also like this draft man is there and all so you can go through this full notification okay go through this full notification and uh, this is basically we can say the registration fees okay and these are the physical uh, uh, basically uh, parameters required for these post trainee category 1 and stipend trainee category 2 so you can go through this and uh, here are the centers for uh, we can say uh, written test examination and these are the documents required so this is all about this notification if you have any doubt then you can please mention in the comment section and before leaving this video just subscribe or just press press this that bell icon and subscribe the channel so that you will get regular updates okay